good, my rags and fitness people, my rags and fitness folks, my rags and fitness fam. It's your man Rags back off up in this thing. I wanna tell you, I'm all up in it. I'm knee deep all up in it. To all my subscribers, man, all my people that's been paying attention to this journey that I got going on, I appreciate you. Please stay tuned. Rock with your boy. For all my new people that come in and view, you know, you come in, pay attention every now and then. Hey, man, just hit the subscribe button, man. Just go ahead. Stay tuned with this little journey that I got going on, man. And we about to go real, real, real far, man. I'm telling y'all that right now. Um, I know y'all hear the noise going on, but once again, I'm on my back porch. I have to turn my air conditioner on on my back porch because it's uh, very hot. I'm already sweating, and if I didn't have that on, it'd be a torrential downpour out here. So, today is Monday. Today is weigh-in day. Now, we're going to have to get this thing here situated right. Because I hate the way it's so close all up in my face, in my mouth, my grill. But, <laughs> we're going to have to get this thing situated, man, where I can sit my camera down and we can do this whole weigh-in. Now, I'm not sure exactly what I'm going to be when I step on this scale here in a second. Uh, I put in the work this week. Uh, my nutrition still been the same, been pretty good. Uh, eating a lot of uh, air fried foods. Um, what else? I still been in taking a few carbohydrates, not many, but a few because I'm weightlifting and I need that energy throughout my weightlifting. Now, what I do is I do weightlifting on certain body groups each part of the week. Say, for instance, Monday, which is today, I'm going to work chest. Tuesday, just because I like my arms, and um, I, I always have been in love with my arms, so I split them up. On Tuesday, I work my biceps, and on Wednesday, I work my triceps. So a whole four day of working out biceps one day, and a whole four day of working out triceps the next day, which is Wednesday. On Thursday, I do... Um, back and shoulders. Now, I used to do legs on Thursday, back and shoulders. I mean, uh, <laughs> I used to do legs on Thursdays and back and shoulders on Fridays. But Friday is a work day, a 12 hour work day, and I haven't got back in the swing of things, so I have neglected my legs so far. But I will incorporate that soon. It's not gonna be something that's gonna be a, a continuous type thing of me neglecting my legs. I will get back on it soon. Um, Today is weigh-in day. Last week, we weighed in at 349 pounds. I came down off that 350 mark, right? We started off recording at 365 pounds. But in the beginning of this year, I was 377. So I came down 377, 365, three, what was it? Wait, 365, I hit 350-something, I can't remember, but and all in all, last week, I was 349 pounds. Now, today is weigh-in day. Don't matter what we do, what the scale look like, I know that I put in the hard work, and I want you guys to trust me when I tell you that I put in the hard work. It's going to become a point in time to where the scale may not even move at all. You know what I'm saying? But whatever it shows, um, I put in the hard work, and I'm going to continue to put in the hard work because this is a whole journey. I'm, think I'm about to stop even calling this a journey because sometimes a journey may end. You know what I'm saying? This right here is going to be something that's infinite, infinite, or however you want to pronounce it or whatever you want to say about it. This right here is going to be something that I love to do. You know what I mean? And hopefully in my future, my near future, I'm going to turn this into my occupation. Uh, whether I'm doing it on YouTube, whether I'm going to a gym doing it, no matter what's going on, I'm going to eventually end up probably turning this into an occupation. Um, and I have a pretty good occupation. I have a really good career right now, and I may. I'm going to try to incorporate this in with that, but if that interferes with what I have going on now, I may, you know, some things may have to, what Beyonce say, to the left, to the left. But anyway, hey, the day way in day, I don't want to keep y'all long. I got to go do some things, you know what I'm saying? Need to go get me a cut, get trimmed up for real, for real. But I like struggling, scraggly look, because that's what I do. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But hey, let's get ready to step on this scale. Y'all excuse my back porch. 
right? Here we go. Let's heat it. Stop. Check him out. Like on this right jungle, we're going to step up on this thing here. We're going to do it like this. Where we at? There we go. We're looking at right. 348.1. But this week, let focus in on it now. Get all of that. Let's get all of that perspective right there. Hey, so for this week, we lost one pound. And I tell you one thing, I take it all day every day. That's one pound. Actually, it's one point something. I ain't been counting them points. I know a lot of y'all say, man, you gotta count the points. So actually, it's closer maybe to two pounds. We're gonna say one pound, right? So in the whole grand scheme of things, we done lost 17 pounds. Wait, is it 17 or is it 18? Either one of them. Let me calculate it up and get back with you. <laughs> we done lost some weight, y'all. We done lost close to 20 pounds. And uh, I'm feeling good. It's the first weigh-in of uh, August. Today is August 2nd, 2021. For time references. Because when we look back on this, we're going to say, man, we done came a long way, dog. We done came a long way. So that was today's weigh-in, August 2nd, 2021. And this is a Monday. So, everything's been good, been eating good, been uh, exercising. Uh, I feel like I could, I could I'm, feel, I'm beginning to see my muscle definition a little bit better. I don't wanna say, I might shouldn't use the word definition, I can see everything coming to again. And that's at 348 pounds now. So just imagine when I get down to the 300 and then the 250s and then the 220s and then the maybe 200s even if I want to go that area I'm going to play it by ear and I'm going to see what it looks like I'm going to play it by eye I mean I said by ear I'm going to play it by eye and see what it looks like at each weight and see what I want to do you know what I'm saying now I told you guys the other day that Rags is uh, pursuing a uh, personal trainer personal how did I mess that word up like <laughs> <laughs> personal trainer um, cert, you know what I mean? And I'm really going to dig in deep to that. I'm going to study every word, everything that I can study about that. And I'm going to uh, bring a lot of that to you guys. I'm going to put a lot of that into my, well, I'm putting all of it into my everyday life. And once you guys see me living, you guys will see that I'm really practicing what I preach. You know what I mean? So, that's gonna be the next step. Red's gonna get that personal. I'm not even gonna say I'm gonna try to get it. I'm telling you, Red is gonna get it. We're gonna get it. This channel, Rags and Fitness, will be a certified personal trainer's page here soon in the near future. Right? So I'm gonna be able to give you guys some tips, some professional tips and stuff. Even if I have to read it straight out of my study guides, I will be able to give you professional tips. You know what I'm saying? That you guys can follow and this one thing i want you to know is i want you to see where i'm starting it so if i when i get to that point to where i'm like really into the swing of things you can say i watched him at his bottom i watched him grow i watched him use his own techniques i watched him practice what he preached in his whole fitness journey his whole fitness what i can say lifestyle right that's what i want you guys to be able to say i'm not going to be somebody that just popped up out of the blue that was already cut up and ripped, trying to tell you what to do or even trying to coach you or, or sway you into a way of what to do, right? I'm gonna be somebody that can sit here and tell you some professional tips and you can see that I've used it on myself. You see what I'm saying? So I really think it's a good situation to be in. Um, you can look at, anybody can look at that situation and they can feel like, hey man, listen, I'm 348 pounds, I'm obese, I'm probably classified as morbidly, I'm pretty sure it's morbidly obese, you know, and I'm sitting here trying to lose it at the same time, having other different barriers in my life, work, family, uh, social, any other kind of things in my life that's trying to hold me back, but I'm not, I'm going forward with everything that I'm doing, right? And hopefully, there's somebody out there that can connect with this and can watch this and see and really do it with me. We can do it together. You know what I'm saying? If you got any questions, reach out to me. I used to put my email and stuff into the description. Um, I need to start back doing that. Um, I will start doing that soon. 
I'm gonna fix up the description and stuff so you guys will be able to, if anybody wanna reach out, talk about anything, uh, we'll be able to do that. But right now, I have to show you guys the results first. You know what I'm saying? Show you what I'm doing. I can talk it all day, but if I show you, it'll put something in. And believe me when I tell you, I said it before, and I'm gonna say it again, and I mean it. Rex is that guy, and I'm gonna walk it down, baby. When I tell you, or you know what the definition of walking something down is? I'm gonna walk it down. <laughs> and I'm gonna walk it down the right way. You're gonna see all this go. I've showed you me being at a certain weight. If you go down through my, my YouTube page, I've showed you me being a certain weight. I've showed you me losing that weight, a, a, a little bit of it. I've showed you me falling off me gaining even more weight, 300, going up to 377 pounds. Now I'm showing you me lose it again. And this time, I'm gonna show you me keeping it off and me having a positive mindset and having a positive lifestyle going into with this thing. So don't never tell yourself if, don't never say when, say I am gonna do it. And you're gonna do it, you're gonna get there. Right? So we're gonna talk about a lot of little, little different things that I'm learning in my studies, man. And, um, it's so helpful. To me, I already see it that I was going down that, 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 that path, but to read it, it's a lot better. I really feel good about it. So y'all, you see that 348 pounds is what I am today. Um, I have also shared with you guys before pictures, before I gained a lot of weight when I was a younger guy, I was uh, like, when I was like 230 pounds, 215 and all that stuff, I looked good, I felt good. And if you look on my little, my little what they call that thing my little profile picture thing that's on youtube that's me when i was at a certain weight i was nice very nice looking but i can get even better than that that was me probably at what about 220 some pound i can do even better than that i can do even better than that it ain't just about the, the weight it's about the the look and it's also about the feel, because if I felt so good about myself back then, I wouldn't have gained this weight and been where I am right now. So, I know it seemed like a rent, guys, but I've been reading and I've been feeling real good about this whole thing. Um, uh, to call myself personal trainer rags is gonna be a great thing, man, you know what I'm saying? And to be able to help somebody on a professional level, I will become a professional at this, and to help somebody on a professional level, it's gonna be great. It's gonna be great, man. You know what I'm saying? And I don't want you to go to no other than a man himself, Rags. <laughs> so, hey, y'all, look, subscribe, man. Like, share, comment, and I'm gonna get back with y'all already. Yeah, y'all.